Sajan. Hi, I'm Diana Fahadila from English Education. So, I would like to interview Mr. Lahmudin. Uh, tolong perkenalkan nama, umur, sekolah, dan teaching experience. Uh, well, my name is Lahmudin. I'm 50, 50 years old. I'm one of this of I'm one of English teacher at Man Tua Kudus, and I have been teaching in Man Tua Kudus since 1996 until now. So, what does the teacher believe about the role of an English teacher? Uh, I believe that the role of English here is as a partner of the student. The teacher is now is not a subject because the curriculum used now is curriculum 30, so the student as a subject. The role of the teacher here as a partner of the student when they have a problem about English anytime and everywhere. If they have a problem, for the first time they can ask uh, they can ask and discuss about the problem with their friend. Mm -hmm. Could you give an example of case in which the teacher applies a method and the reason for adopting such method? Uh, for me, according to me that before starting English teaching, for the first one, I give information about uh, the rule of following English teaching. There, number one, the student have to come on time. The second one, the student are not attend late and anytime they have homework the homework uh, the homework uh, has been submitted on time if they didn't do the homework, maybe I'll give them punishment. Uh, what is the reason for adopting such method? Uh, because I believe that English without practice is only a dreaming and it is impossible for them to get better in achievement. How do you usually deal with the student's mistake? What do you mean? The student's mistake. When the students make a mistake, and what do you do? Uh, for me, if the student do mistake, especially in doing homework, I don't care. Because I believe that by doing mistake, the student will know, will know whether they do homework well or not. Once again, that by doing homework, although they make mistake, for me, I don't care. And then, do you have any experience of misbehaved students? Uh, misbehaved students? Example, my student, his name is Bagus. Yes, uh, Bagus often forget uh, to do his homework. So uh, the punishment, the punishment for him is I ask him to do the homework first and then to check his homework 
I'll ask him to answer uh, and write on the whiteboard. After writing his homework on the whiteboard, uh, I'll ask my student to analyze whether his homework is true or not. If his homework is true, uh, I and my student give him applause. And if he made mistake, I'll ask him to analyze which one of the sentence is mistake. And I'll, I also ask him to open the pattern. This is one, uh, one method I use in teaching English at M2P. Okay, thank you for the information. That's the end of our interview. Thank you for your attention and see you later. Pattern.